What's up, guys? Turtle here, and yeah, welcome to Smore. This is Minecraft Survival. And yeah, we're using the John Smith texture pack. I know I said I'd use the Dwarven one, but I really didn't like the look of the Dwarven one. It was just far too golden. So yeah, as you can see, unfortunately the water textures are a little broken, so I don't know what's tripping there. Yeah, we can stand on top of the fountain. I can't believe I couldn't do this early, but I can do it now on the first try. It's a little embarrassing. Ah, blast. The phone turned off. I need that to stay on. Not much light in this room. Okay, yeah, so I think it's this episode. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to do some more work here. Actually, I didn't show you guys this yet, did I? Yes, I've been busy, very busy in between episodes building this. I think I need to settle somewhere else. Actually, yeah, instead of building the railroad first, we need to settle somewhere. If you guys know what I mean, it makes no sense to go somewhere and not have anything there. So, yeah, um, let's get my shovel out. Where is it? Here it is. And we're just going to charge straight through here. So, first things first, we need to make a path. Get out of the way, tree. It's official, um, business. Settling business. Yeah. Okay. I have a feeling this is going to take a while. But yeah, I suppose once we get to the other side of this mountain, if it even is a mountain, or at least a tiny hill, hmm, how are we going to do this? This is really complicated. I mean, not the digging part, but actually finding a place to settle. I mean, you can travel endless amount of blocks and not actually find anywhere to settle, and and that gets really annoying. Oh god, more block glitches. Okay, I'm gonna pull out of the ground here. Okay, well, we found something. That's for certain. But where do we want to go with this? Because I don't see anything useful nearby. Well, there's cows and sheep. I mean, this continent is pretty small, I must say. I mean, there's a tiny water hole. But apart from that, I really don't see anything else here. This feels like an island, probably because it is. What's in this direction? Okay, I have an XYZ coordinate set. Okay. you just water. We're trapped on a giant island. Well, maybe later we're going to figure a way out of this, but I think we're just going to hold off the railway project for now for just on an island. Maybe later I can make a giant bridge. Yeah, we're just going to leave it at bay and leave the second line to connect to somewhere. And maybe another station somewhere else on the island. But the thing is, yes, this episode I want to do some exploring now. <coughs> Excuse my voice, I was just eating something. A bit of crumb got stuck in my throat now. Very uncomfortable, I may say. Okay, let's explore this way, because um, I have a feeling this island has a lot more to offer. So, minus 20, 70, two, minus 227. I forget those coordinates. Uh, as you guys may notice, I am using Block Launcher and uh, the XYZ mod. Oh, and stop dying on me. So it's not dying, it's, um, it's on a timer to automatically shut off. Yeah, this is the area we were gazing at when we were over there. Seems though we've stayed at about minus 20, 70. Except we've moved uh, about 100 blocks now. Where are we going? Oh, I hope it's somewhere good. Hashtag horrible singing skills. Oh god, I can't see anything that I've made. If this is legitimately just a, an, an island trap, I don't know what I'm going to do here. I mean, I guess I could build a railway to this side, but... Oh, I see something in the water. Yeah, it's not anything. This is kind of depressing. This feels like where we started. Because I, I think I remember we started on an island. You know, yeah, we're just going to head back now. There's, no, there's really nothing else here. Eventually, we're going to have to explore somewhere else. Yeah, and I've already 
lava this high. That is super rare. Yeah, maybe later we'll come back here and explore this cave. Because I see a huge adventure. Actually, maybe it, just in case the cave is too small. I mean, if the, if the cave is large enough, it could be a decent adventure. But yeah, I have a feeling for now this whole island is just far too small to provide me with anything useful. Whoa! Leap skills, tiny ravine. Yeah, I'm just gonna go in circles, aren't I? This is just one big island. I wish I had a mini-map so badly. A mini-map would be so useful right now. So useful. It feels so plain here. I really don't like this. I can't live with this. I feel so happy. <laughs> I still am, but I'm just not entirely... Whoa, I was just disoriented there. Okay, let's get back to minus 20. Here we go. Already see my civilization. And more caves, that's always a good sign. Yeah, yeah, I think the next thing we might want to do is explore some caves. But, you know what, screw it. Um, I, I'm going to mark my coordinates down somewhere. Yeah, so it's minus 20. Um, I'm going to leave it, it's about, my, my island is about mi minus 20, 70, 200. Because that, because those coordinates land on my island. Yeah, they land about here. Yeah, they land somewhere over there in a straight line. But, yeah, for now, I'm going to take a boat and we're going to go on a bit of an adventure. First, I need to write these coordinates down so I can come back to this video just in case. I don't think this is actually hard, very hard to forget. It just minus 20, 70, 200. Just in case I forget. Oh, uh, do I have a sign on me? Phone, stop dying. I need you awake. Yeah, you know, what? yeah. The plan for this episode, we're just gonna prepare for an adventure, and um, I'm gonna take this with our coordinates. Ooh, only fight a book. Book. I need a book. No, wrong thing. Right, so minus twenty, um, seventy, and um, minus two hundred. Okay. Yes, stupid phone. Not gonna die this time. Okay, let's hop up here. Yeah, I suppose we're gonna get ready to go. I'm yes, we have more than enough food. I'm certain of that. Okay, let's go put some of our junky wood stuffs away that we don't need right now, and grab a little bit of wood for our way back. Maybe we'll take one sapling, seeing that we don't end up in a desert biome out in the middle of nowhere. I think this is not enough wood I have on me. Okay, that should be barely enough wood. <laughs> I'm going to put this away. I can't put anything not wood in here. Yeah, well, for now, I think this is a good amount. I'm going to make a little more bread. Okay, and that's stored into hay bales. Why do I even have wool here? Right, I need a bed. Thank me for keeping that on me. Okay, a bed. Yeah, I suppose I can put that in there. It doesn't make much of a big difference. I mean, wool can go with wood. Okay, wait, I need to make a boat. What am I doing with life? <laughs> so, a wooden shovel. A little more wood. A little more. Where's the boat? Yes, oak boat. Okay, I'm ready to set off on my adventure. The wonderful adventure of... That makes that rhyme makes absolutely no sense. <laughs> okay, YOLO, let's go. I have 30 bread. We're gonna leave from my little pier here. Yeah, hopefully we're gonna go on a straight line. If we don't find anything, I'll see. I'll see what I can do to head back immediately. Find a stupid boat. Board. Yes. Are we aligned correctly? Again, phone, please do not die. Oh, God, I can't see anything. Oh. And we're off. We're sailing off into the heavens. I think we can figure out. There's already land, sweet Jesus. This 
I recognize this biome. This is a biome we desperately want. It has so much dang clay in it. And apparently there's an automatic cave, which is a huge plus for me and us. Can't get too greedy by saying me instead of us. Man, this is so cool. Can I still see my island? I cannot. That is the only inconvenient thing. How close do I have to get? Yeah, I have just have to get this close, and I can see both of them. That is so cool. And there's a little squid. Yeah, let's do a little bit of... You know, we don't even have to actually travel that far. I'm going to say we mine one of these blocks. This is going to take a century. Oh, God, and it didn't even go up. Oh, that's sand. Well, that isn't good. I'll break it better. It'll be better if I break it with my fist, actually. Okay, let's leave the boat and see where we go. Oh, we're off on an adventure. A wonderful adventure to go somewhere. This is quite plain. What happens if I break this? Playing for the sticks, Bush. Yeah, there isn't much here except the incredible colors of this biome. I, it's not a Mesa biome, but it's one of the new biomes they added in a few months ago, I think it was. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was a few months ago. I think it's a clay biome. I think there's also an ice sculptures biome, but I don't know where to find that. Okay, I'm pretty happy with our find. I'm just going to leave this, he this island here. I'm not going to end the episode yet. But yeah, I think I know where I want my railroad to go now. You guys picking up what I'm putting down? Because this is where I want my railroad to lead now. Hopefully it's not too inconvenient to reposition it. Whoa, did I just see gold? Yes, I did. I'm on a conquest for gold. Woo, that'll, that is really going to help with the railway. And now we have some more gold. Let's get back up. Well, not exactly do stuff. We got to get back first. And I smelt that gold. Come on, I don't want to board the boat without going into the water. Board, you stupid thing. Oh, God, I was shifting, that's why. Board. Yes! Okay, let's reposition ourselves and shoot down this way. And we're heading in an almost perfectly straight line. Well, in the texture of the block. Looking towards dock. Blast, my phone just turned off. But no big deal. We have bigger things to do. Come on, little boat. This thing travels so quickly, and I'm so happy of that. Hey, I didn't notice this before, but my dock is placed on... Oh, I thought that was one of the, one of the three new oars they had, or I mean, rocks they added in. Yeah, I think we'll just leave our boat parked right here. Yeah, right here. No, not there. Here, turn around like this, up here. Yeah, okay, I'm satisfied. Let me move forward. The reason I look back is to make sure the boat wasn't zooming away. I better not touch this with the torch or break it at all. It has a high chance of falling down if I'm not careful. As you guys may know, sometimes stuff spawns in weird and um, defies Minecraft laws and physics. And like there are such things as Minecraft physics. So yeah, I think I know what we, I want to do next episode. Um, try and... You know, you know, is it hold off that, um, the railroad project? I think we're going to reposition the railroad. But since I've already used up a bit of, quite a bit of time for this episode, and we're, we're only just going to figure out how to turn it and maybe just make a one-block outline. Yeah, I think that's a good enough plan. Uh, I do have a spare bed, just in case I need to sleep the night through. And it's peaceful mode. Okay, let's get hopping over here, quite literally. <laughs> that was a stupid joke. I'm sure you guys can agree. Okay, so it, it looks like it should work if I just turn now. I mean, I haven't really placed torches beyond this one. Yeah, this should work. 
If it doesn't work, I don't know what I'll, I'll probably I'll I'm I'll be damned. I'll be damned. But if you guys haven't watched the or listened to a recording of the Alexander Hamilton Broadway show, it is an incredible show. I absolutely love it. I listened to the music about a thousand times. Well not literally actually maybe, but I doubt it. But but literally the music is so dang good. You guys should really listen to it. I don't think I'm going to put it in my videos because all that copyright stuff. And I don't want to get a strike on my channel, if that's even possible. Because I've heard of channel strikes before. I've never known anyone to actually get one. Where's... I don't have a backup shovel. Really? Well, whatever. We'll just punch it. So, anyway, lately there has been um, a slight decline in subscribers. I mean, that's kind of a bad thing, but it went back up slightly. I mean... We dropped below 10 subscribers for, I think, a few minutes or a couple of hours. I don't know. But at least we didn't go below 10 for too long. And it that was kind of embarrassing for me personally. But I have to share this with you guys in case any of you dudes missed it. How thick is this hill? I can't have it being too dense. At least there's stone, something I can break through faster. It'd probably be much more efficient if I just made a crafting table. Just coal... And, um, crafted a shovel. But I have a strange feeling that we're getting out the other side. And why cannot I move? Okay, pick. Don't fail me now. I gotta get to the other side of this ruddy mountain. Because it literally feels like a dang mountain. Not kidding, peeps. How many centuries have I been digging for now? I can't see anything. That's better now, but... Ooh, I broke through some cool rocks. Okay, let's keep digging. Just keep digging. Have you guys heard that... Have you guys heard that, um, Finding Dory is coming out? Yeah, some of you littler kids might want to watch that. Oh, I have a bad... Huh, I was about to say I have a bad feeling about this because I thought water was going to pour down. But it seems that we're far too high. Okay. And maybe we can just reroute it around here a little bit. I mean, that's a little bit of a waste of resources, but... To me, it's not really. So that's just one pretty dense wall. And did my pick break? Because the most inconvenience, my pick did break. I don't have the faintest idea how long I've been recording for now. But I think I'm going to leave the episode here. I think that was a pretty good episode. Um, uh, if I can remember, I'll put the link for the Texture Pack MCPE Minecraft Pocket Edition Texture Pack. And I, as you do know, I, well, you should know, if you watched the video or at least saw it, um, yeah, these coordinates will, might not be useful, but I'll keep them there anyway. Anyway, I thank you dudes. And actually, uh, before the episode, I'm going to leave you guys in the action. We're making a pickaxe. Dun dun. That's not much action. And the stupid sound keeps getting in my way. So yeah. Excellent. Just mosey on over here. Oh, I need to make two pickaxes because I always run out of those guys. Oh my god. My inventory is so full. Let's go empty it. Well, I mean, some of the, I know that some of the things I've been doing lately here have not been all that exciting. But finally, we found a continent. I mean, that was probably one of the most exciting things we've done so far, apart from the texture packs that we've seen here, which I've absolutely loved. What is this? Because this isn't cobblestone. I've never noticed that before. I think it's stone. It can't be, though. Alright, and we need to finish the basement, too. The moss bricks look absolutely super sweet. Okay, let's go put this stuff away. Uh, my spare bed. Too much dirt. Whoever made dirt in for Minecraft, I mean, of course they would have put dirt in it. Who wouldn't? That'd make no sense, but sometimes there's just too much. <laughs> um... Right, so let's go smell this gold. One coal should be sufficient. Where's my coal? Right, I keep it in this chest. Okay, come on. I want to hop onto this dang chest. 
Okay, let's see. Have I been keeping anything in here? If not, I'm just going to slam these in here. I'm probably going to check these anyway. I wonder if I can activate my furnace in third person view. Man, I look awesome in this. I love this texture pack so much. Hey, look at that. I can access it. That's kind of cool. Although I can't see the bar. That's kind of annoying. Look at this. Oh my god, my blue hair going through. That looks kind of funny. <laughs> Come on. Can I tap the furnace from here? Oh my god, I can. That is magic. Well, of course it's not. Look how sweet these gold bars look, dudes. That totally makes up for all the gold bars I've used so far. That is simply awesome sauce. Now let's tap on this. I'm going to take this, turn these into blocks. Ooh, first time having two blocks. The blocks are kind of ugly, though. I mean, the tech. I love the texture pack and all, but as I did say in the mod review, I mean, the blocks of metal look really weird from, from my perspective. Can I do third-person view in bed? I think that's probably how I'm going to end off the video. Oh, God, that doesn't work at all. <laughs> um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to slap that like button. Nothing in here? Okay. Um, I'm going to check... Okay, good. Anyway, thank you guys and so much for watching. And be sure to slap the like button if you've enjoyed. I feel like I'm going too fast. And there's also a bit of redundancy. As I said, if you... Thanks so much for watching. Anyway, that again. And then be sure to like if you enjoyed. And hashtag redundant. Hashtag redundant on redundant. Be sure to subscribe if you have not yet already. And I will see you dudes in the next video. See you guys.